Did you know that we know less about the ocean's depths than the surface of the moon? Yes, you heard that right. The vast expanse of our oceans, the very cradle of life, remains a grand enigma, holding secrets that boggle the mind and challenge our understanding of the world. The ocean, this great unknown, covers over 70% of our planet, yet we've only explored a mere 5% of it. Imagine that, an alien world right here on Earth, teeming with mysteries and wonders beyond our wildest dreams. It's like having the universe's biggest treasure chest, but we've only just peeked inside the keyhole. Now, you might wonder, why is that? Why have we not delved deeper into the ocean's depths? The answer lies in the inherent challenges of deep sea exploration. The ocean is not just a large body of water. It's a realm of crushing pressures, pitch black darkness and extreme temperatures that make exploration a formidable task. It's a world where the rules of life as we know them are rewritten, where creatures defy the odds and thrive in conditions that would be inhospitable, even lethal, to most life forms. These challenges have left so much of the ocean unexplored. It's like a giant jigsaw puzzle with most of its pieces missing. And yet, each new discovery, each glimpse into this alien world, brings us one step closer to unveiling the ocean's hidden secrets. From the deepest trenches to the tallest underwater mountains, from the smallest microbes to the largest creatures on Earth, the ocean's depths hold stories waiting to be told, mysteries itching to be solved. And as we push the boundaries of technology and human courage, we inch closer to unveiling these secrets to understanding our planet and our place in the cosmos. What lies beneath the waves is a mystery waiting to be unveiled. Each ripple, each bubble, each grain of sand holds a secret of its own, a piece of the grand puzzle that is our world. So join us as we dive into the unknown, into the ocean's hidden secrets. The deeper you go, the stranger it gets. No truer words have been spoken about our vast and largely unexplored oceans. These enchanting bodies of water aren't just a monotonous blue expanse. They are made up of distinct layers, each with its unique characteristics and inhabitants. The uppermost layer known as the sunlit zone is where sunlight filters in, giving life to algae and a myriad of sea creatures. It's a bustling marine metropolis filled with colors and vibrancy. But as we descend deeper the light fades and we enter the twilight zone, a dimly lit world that's home to bioluminescent creatures that glow in the dark to attract prey or deter predators. But venture further down and you'll find the midnight zone, a realm so deep that sunlight cannot penetrate it. Here, the temperatures plummet, the pressure is crushing, and the darkness is complete. Yet this seemingly hostile environment is home to some of the most bizarre creatures on Earth. Creatures that have adapted to thrive under conditions that would be lethal to most life forms. Beyond the midnight zone, we reach the abyssal plain, a flat and seemingly desolate expanse. But don't be fooled by its apparent barrenness. This is a world teeming with life, from giant tube worms that feed on bacteria, to deep sea cucumbers that sift through the ocean floor for nutrients. And finally, at the very bottom, we have the Hadal Zone, the deepest part of the ocean found in deep sea trenches. Here, the pressure is over a thousand times that at sea level, and the temperatures hover near freezing. Yet, despite these extremes, life persists. From the elusive giant squid to the bizarre anglerfish, life in the Hadal Zone truly embodies the phrase, life finds a way. So, as we journey from the sunlit surface to the pitch black abyss, we discover a world that's as diverse as it is mysterious, a world that defies our understanding of life and survival. And the most fascinating part, we've barely scratched the surface of the ocean's depths. There's so much more to explore, so many more mysteries to unravel, yet despite these extreme conditions, life finds a way. In the ocean's depths, creatures unlike anything seen on land thrive. It's a world so alien, so extraordinary, it's as if you've journeyed to another planet. Let's start with the bioluminescent fish. These are not your average goldfish. No, these fish have the remarkable ability to produce their own light through a process known as bioluminescence. Imagine, in the pitch black depths of the ocean, these creatures are their own lighthouses, illuminating their surroundings with a mesmerizing glow. This light isn't just for show, it serves a series of vital functions from attracting prey to deterring predators, and even communicating with potential mates. Next, we dive deeper to encounter the giant tube worms. Now these are no ordinary worms. They can reach up to 8 feet in length and live in clusters around hydrothermal vents. These vents spew out superheated mineral-rich water, an environment that would be toxic to most life forms. 
but not for these tube worms. They've adapted to not only survive but to flourish in these extreme conditions. They do this by forming a symbiotic relationship with bacteria living inside them. These bacteria convert the toxic chemicals from the vents into nutrients, providing the tube worms with a constant food supply. In return, the tube worms offer the bacteria a safe home. It's a remarkable example of adaptation and survival. These deep sea dwellers, the bioluminescent fish, the giant tube worms and countless others, have evolved over millions of years to thrive in conditions that are unimaginable to us. They endure the crushing pressure, the freezing temperatures and the eternal darkness of the deep sea. They've developed unique, often bizarre characteristics to survive, to hunt, and to mate. The deep sea is a testament to the adaptability and resilience of life. It's a world where the ordinary is extraordinary, where the impossible becomes possible. And it's right here, on our planet, hidden beneath the waves. These creatures remind us of the resilience of life, even in the harshest environments. The mysteries of the deep are vast and many and we've only just begun to uncover them. The ocean is not just a vast, mysterious world, it plays a crucial role in our planet's health. Think of the ocean as the world's largest climate regulator. It's like a giant thermostat, absorbing over 90% of the heat trapped by greenhouse gases. This colossal heat buffer helps to stabilize our planet's temperature, providing us with a livable climate. But as we emit more greenhouse gases, the ocean's ability to absorb heat is stretched to its limits. This results in warmer ocean temperatures, which can lead to more intense storms and rising sea levels. Moreover, the ocean is also our planet's largest carbon sink. It absorbs about a quarter of all carbon dioxide emissions. Tiny marine plants known as phytoplankton are the heroes here. They take in carbon dioxide for photosynthesis, just as trees do on land. But unlike trees, when these tiny plants die, they sink to the ocean floor, taking the carbon with them. This process, known as the biological carbon pump, helps to keep carbon dioxide levels in check, reducing the impact of global warming. But the ocean's role doesn't stop there. It's also one of the planet's major oxygen producers. That's right, every second breath you take, you can thank the ocean. Again, it's our tiny friends, the phytoplankton, doing the heavy lifting. Through photosynthesis, they generate half of the world's oxygen supply. Understanding the deep sea is crucial to understanding and combating climate change. The deep ocean is a vast, unexplored frontier holding secrets that could help us better predict climate patterns and develop innovative solutions to climate change. For instance, studying deep sea organisms could reveal new ways to capture and store carbon. The deep sea, though remote and inaccessible, is closer to our daily lives than we might think. The more we learn about the ocean's mysteries, the more we realize just how interconnected we are with this vast blue world. It's not just a place of wonder and exploration, it's a crucial part of our planet's life support system. The exploration of the ocean's depths is just beginning. As we sail into the future, we are armed with increasingly advanced technologies that promise to unveil the ocean's enigmatic secrets. Unmanned submersibles like autonomous underwater vehicles, AUVs, are shaping the future of ocean exploration. These robotic explorers can plunge into the ocean's deepest trenches, withstand the crushing pressures, and capture images and data that human explorers could only dream of. But the future is not just about going deeper. It's also about understanding more. Cutting-edge technologies like artificial intelligence and machine learning are being harnessed to analyze the reams of data collected, helping us to discern patterns, understand ecosystems, and predict future changes. On the horizon we see initiatives like the Seabed 2030 project, a global endeavor to map the entire ocean floor by the end of the decade. Imagine that, a complete map of our ocean floors revealing every ridge, trench and seamount. This could pave the way for discoveries that could change our understanding of the planet. But let's not forget the human element. New generation of submersibles are being designed to take human explorers deeper than ever before, withstanding immense pressures and extreme temperatures. Who knows what wonders they will witness firsthand? Perhaps they'll discover new life forms, geological wonders, or even clues about the origins of life on Earth. And let's not forget about the potential for exploration beyond our own planet. As we develop technologies and techniques for exploring our own oceans, we're also preparing for the exploration of oceans on other worlds like Jupiter's moon, Europa. The future of ocean exploration is a thrilling prospect full of potential and promise. It's a future where the unknown becomes known, where mysteries are unraveled, and where every discovery brings us closer to understanding our place in the cosmos.
As we continue to explore, we will cover.